So I'm at a place in Maine, in Cobbs Cook Bay, that has this sedimentary rock that's known for having small fossils in it. And I thought it would be fun to bring the family over and see if we can find some fossils. Cameraman Todd, how's it going here? Pretty well, we're getting there. There's millions of year of progress here. We're just gonna be through it. You can see how the rock splits really easily because it has these sedimentary layers and in the layers the, the rock is actually very weak and it breaks easily. This guy looks very promising. It's pretty big. I don't know if we can get a... thought for sure this one would have something in it, but nothing. Scour the beach, and Liam finds one to try. Aha! Yeah, this is a good one. Right there, yeah. and right there. So let's see if we can crack this guy in a little bit better angle. Check it out. There's one or two in there, you yeah. see them? So we got one here, and one there. You can see the other sides of them on this one where it went together. Nobody said this would be easy. You gotta break a lot of rocks to find a good fossil. Now that we've collected half the beach, and are bringing it home with us, let's depart. When many people think of fossils, they think of dinosaurs. Now, we weren't exactly finding dinosaur fossils, but we did find some pretty cool stuff. These rocks have mostly marine invertebrates in them. So this was mud and it had little clams and mussels and even some barnacles we found. And you can see them when you split the rock open. So we've got some pretty cool ones here. And mostly everything that's identifiable is some kind of a bivalve, a two-shelled mollusk, like a clam. These guys over here, those are some little white mussels. And here's a really easy to see mussel, I mean uh, clam. And what do we have over here? And that is a barnacle, almost perfect barnacle fossil. So that's pretty cool stuff. And you know, all it took was a hammer and a chisel and breaking open some rocks. So there are a lot of places, not even near the ocean, just everywhere where you can find fossils. There's probably a place near you where you can go crack open some rocks and try to find some fossils of your own. Hey everyone, thanks for watching our latest episode all the way to the end. You're crazy if you don't subscribe. Hit that subscribe button now so you won't miss our next episode. And check out our merch link in the description for some Blue World swag.